Welcome to the campus of Palm Beach Atlantic University, a very important day in the life of the Lemieux Center for Public Policy. Today, the Lemieux Center for Public Policy, named after former United States Senator George Lemieux, takes its second step. Its first step was bringing distinguished Americans, wonderful citizens who believe in America, to come to the university campus to engage with our faculty, our students, our alumni, and our friends in a serious conversation on public affairs. Today, we are pleased to announce that second milestone for the Lemieux Center for Public Policy. That second milestone focuses on our students. And we are pleased today to announce the first, the inaugural Lemieux Fellows. Dr. Not yet. <laughs> Good clip. Good clip. Senator George Lemieux. Thank you very much, President Fleming. It's an honor to be back here today at Palm Beach Atlantic, and it's an honor to announce the second phase of what we put forth when we announced the Lemieux Center for Public Policy, and that is our fellowship program. Uh, the purpose of the fellowship program is to allow students to work with their faculty as well as to have an opportunity for me to work with them on an issue of great public importance, something that's either facing Florida, the nation, or the world. And the goal is that these students with this time of research and study will have the opportunity to present a paper to the student body as well as to the community that will hopefully find some answers to these challenges and opportunities that face our state and our country. And I'm pleased today to announce the first two Lemieux Fellows, which for me is just a great personal uh, moment of pride and joy. We had a great group of people who submitted for this uh, fellowship. Any one of them would have been great uh, in this uh, fellowship, but at the onset we decided to just start with two, so we're doing with that today. So I'm pleased to announce that Emily Hardman and Peter Copan are going to be our first two fellows. Uh, Emily has taken on the project of looking at American exceptionalism as it deals with foreign policy. And I think in light of what's been happening in the world, especially if we look at what happened with the Syria uh, controversy and whether or not the United States would become involved after there was the use of chemical weapons, there couldn't be more timely or important topic to tackle. Uh, Peter is very interested in education and educational standards. And this is also an extremely timely time to look at this issue as the country debates the idea of the common core standards, a core set of curriculum for high school students around the country. Something that we've had a curriculum base like that here in Florida, but this would be a national standard. And we'll be able to look at that while lawmakers, while civic leaders are looking at that issue at the very same time. So we will start uh, in the beginning of the year along with a faculty advisor for both Peter and Emily. And we'll work together to try to come to uh, some good answers uh, to these two questions before uh, the spring semester is over. Uh, President Fleming, I'm so pleased to be able again to uh, add my uh, time and my efforts and my energies to Palm Beach Atlantic University. And as always, so impressed with the quality of the students uh, at this great school. Thank you, Senator. Thank you, Thank President you so Fleming. Much. Congratulations. Congratulations. Allow me to invite uh, our two Lemieux Fellows to step forward on this very historic day in the life of the Lemieux Center for Public Policy and Palm Beach Atlantic University. This is a new breakthrough, and we are so honored to be working in this mentoring relationship. One of the themes of Palm Beach Atlantic University is an engaged learning environment. And the Mu Fellows are at the top of the list of engaged learners. Senator, thank you for serving as a mentor to Emily Harden and Peter Copen. Let me invite both of you uh, forward so that we can personally congratulate and thank you for what we know will be serious research and wonderful solution finding. Congratulations. <laughs> Peter, the floor to working with you. Congratulations. Thank you. Emily, congratulations. Really Look forward to working so with you. I'm really excited. Should be great. We'll get a picture. Sure, Peter, why don't we get jump. the two.
Thank you all for, uh, for coming today, and I know that uh, you will be supportive of uh, Emily and Peter in their spring term semester research. We look forward to uh, hearing um, as you pause, you are already um, leading students. S other students see you as leading by examples. Uh, people are watching wherever you are and whatever you're doing. This will be yet another um, opportunity for your peers to watch you, observe you, and you'll set the bar very, very high. High standards will be the result of your research with uh, Senator Lemieux. Senator, I think it's also very, very important that we um, take a moment to acknowledge um, and perhaps let Emily and Peter acknowledge their uh, faculty um, helpers, their faculty uh, guides. And so, Emily and Peter, would you just stand where you are? And uh, uh, actually, why don't you come both forward again? And uh, why don't you uh, introduce uh, uh, your faculty uh, mentors? Um, I, it is my distinct honor to introduce Dr. Roger Chapman as my mentor. Um, he's already helped me so much in this research project, and I'm so grateful that Dr. Kloba advised me to go to him for um, help with researching history and different current events. So I'm looking, I'm so grateful that we'll be working together. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Chapman. <laughs> Peter? And I have the honor and privilege of introducing Professor Francisco Plaza. Um, uh, so glad that for his, and thankful for his help thus far in, uh, and his guidance and look forward to working with him this coming semester. Good. <laughs> Dr. Plaza. <laughs> we thank you for Coming to this uh, announcement, the first announcement. We'll continue to do this in subsequent years, but uh, we're excited mm -hmm. that the Lemieux Fellows are now part of the Lemieux Center for Public Policy at Palm Beach Atlantic University. Have a wonderful afternoon.